Hello UTK printmakers. Today I would like to talk about shinkole. Shinkole is a technique. It's a great way to approach a larger composition while you're having uh, access to small press. I made a large number of the small prints like so and then glue up together and I'd be able to work with a larger composition. First, us using a mylar, submerge under the water, and float the print face down. You cut a mylar so it's easy to handle. And using a towel to move, remove the extra moisture so the paper will be completely uh, stuck to the surface of the mylar. On the back side, apply a rice paste glue. You could use a, a wheat paste or potato starch that would work wonderfully. Important part of this is that uh, make sure there's no wrinkle on the gumpy paper because the uh, drying time of the Reeves BFK, the base paper, and the gumpy paper are slightly different. This gumpy paper is approximately 30 gram per square meter versus uh, Reeves BFK is approximately 250 gram square meter. So it's a lot thicker in the BFK, therefore it takes a longer time to dry. And when process that BFK is drying, it does a stretch and to make that surface completely flat and create a little intensity to the image itself. Before starting collaging, uh, there is a need to stretch the BFK paper on the board first. Same way, apply the water with a spray from the back side and while still wet, uh, using a brown packing tape to glue on the surface of the masonite board in this case. And that will make that Reeves BFK paper completely flat. In this manner, I think you can approach larger composition with limited studio resource. Try to be creative. Challenge some larger competition. Good luck.